Well, well, well. Looks like I caught two little birdies in my trap. Birdies from one of the richest families in the world, of course. I think I'll get a handsome ransom for the two of you, don't you believe? Maybe. If you can convince my father. Oh, he's a stubborn man, I know. But I have my ways of getting what I want. Are you going to hurt us? Only if I have to. Yeah. You could start with some slapping of our faces. Yes. Some spanking to prove your point. That would really get us. What? Why would I slap you? Well, you already have our wrists and ankles bound in the scratchy rope, you naughty minx. Yeah, we know a kingster when we see one. Whoa, whoa, I am not a kingster. Okay, your lives are in serious danger. As serious as the BDSM sex dungeon, you freaky ferret. Yeah, next you're going to tell us those sex weren't part of a sensory deprivation kink. Ew, no, you weirdos, stop. <gasps> Do you hear that, husband? He thinks our sexual preferences are weird. Yeah. How degrading. Degrade us more. Your scorn makes us fat. Hey, look, I'm, I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to, like, kink shame you. I, I'm just trying to express that I do not want to be a part of your kinks. But you're so good at it. You're a natural dom, you saucy badger. No, I'm not. I'm just like a boring sex guy who likes boring sex things, like missionary and sex that takes place in beds, under the covers even. And then, you know, I feel bad about myself afterwards. That's the kind of sex guy I am. Well, it's time to expand your horizons. Right now. With us. You know what? If you don't cut this kink crap out right now, I'm gonna cut off your thumb. Please do. The pain would be exquisite, and I only need these three fingers anyway. Yes, and then to my thumb next, you jaunty cougar melon cow. Uh, how could you possibly think getting your finger cut off is kinky? Okay. Well, you obviously haven't plunged the depths of sexual depravity like we have. No one should ever. Hello? Please let my son and his wife go. Just tell me what you want. Is that my daddy? Has daddy called to save us? Yes, daddy, yes! Shut up, okay? Just shut up. Listen to me very closely. You will never see your son again if you do not wire me $50 million. I bet you want a helicopter too, you nasty thin dom. Your financial demands get me off. Jesus Christ. Listen, just call me back when you're not so horned up. All right, new plan, everybody, all right? We're just gonna sit here and not interact and just listen to the radio, okay? And we're back here. Uh, discussions are heating up here as we discuss the role of the elderly in our society. Uh, it's obviously we're living in a very young world today, uh, but for grandma and grandpa, it's not so. I mean, uh, what are you doing? Is that some kinky non call? But normal has become hot. The snake is eating its own tail, and I think that's sexy as. The snake. Okay, I'm done here, guys. The kidnapping's over. I'm gonna leave the room because I can't be in the same room as you guys. I'd rather be in jail. Thanks a lot. Please, no! No, no! I'll give you $50 million to tie us up all weekend! I'm a virgin! Hey, it's Grant. If you like college humor and want to support us, sign up for Dropout. For the low price of 0.005% of my student loan debt, you'll get shows like Total Forgiveness, where I do stunts to try to pay down said student debt, access to an exclusive Dropout Discord where I'll talk about college loans, and sketches a full week earlier, like this one about my student loans. I studied acting. You took out loans to study acting? It's my one thing. That's it's my whole deal. Sign up for your free trial today. Then pay after that. I... I need it.